Hey guys, and welcome back to the wonders that is surviving Mars. And I say wonders, but actually, the wonder is something that is doing us a little bit of a bad right now. We uh, finished our storyline for the flashbacks to the past of Mars's past. No, I shouldn't have used the word past twice there, but still. Uh, we managed to complete that. Cow won the day with it's been an inspiring legend for all humankind now. But we got this uh, this artificial sun as a prize for that, and you can see it takes an awful lot of metals. So much so that it's actually brought our uh, our colony to a bit of a halt here. So what I'm actually going to do is go into our cargo rockets, go one of these, if we could, uh, please fill the Asimov with more metals. I've, I've not actually spent as much money as I have in the... Sorry, let me start again. I've spent more money since finishing the entire the, the mystery than I have in the entire rest of the game. It's, uh, it's very weird. I, I I didn't think I'd be spending money now, but that now is the time. It's building all these big structures. It's really starting to hit my bottom line. Uh, something else I want to do is go around and have a look at all these buildings that are not working and try and figure out why. Yeah, most of them I'm expecting to say, hey, we're waiting for metals or polymers because my polymer building is waiting for metals, okay? Uh, this one, building is deteriorated. That's fine. I can live with that. Um, still more malfunctioning. Okay, it looks like the majority of these are going to... This one's not. Okay, so this is a, a storage parts. Okay, we can store... Oh. Oh, okay. Maybe, maybe we don't need so many shifts on the go here. Let's let's crank that down a bit. Are you scientists? You should not be here. How do we get rid of you out of here? Specialization scientist. You, yeah, you, you, you shouldn't be here, buddy. You should be down here. Was it down here? Was this where we wanted all our scientists? Ah, that's why, because we are full. Okay, we, we, we can do more and better things with that. Might even do more and better things around here. As we've got most of the production being made anyway, we could put a serious place down here. Maybe one for scientists, but more importantly... Okay, so we, we took care of that. I wasn't too bothered by the storage space being full. And this is just all waiting for stuff. Okay, that, that's fine. The next thing I wanted to do was come and take a look at this slot. This uh, big oval dome over here. You can see that we've got a bit of a homeless problem starting to kick off. So I think the next thing I'm going to do, of course, is to put an extra building down. Something like this should sort us out very well, hopefully. Hopefully, indeed. Okay, now the next thing I want to do is try and kick these up onto high priorities. Because it's just, uh, we need concrete. Concrete is another thing that is uh, failing us. And I think this should do us for a little while until uh, this uh, rocket arrives. Tell you what, this dome here just seems to be the source of all my troubles. It's where we keep putting all the kids. So I can kind of understand why, but we, we need more food down here. We definitely need more food. It's not even a case of we can open up another shift here to, uh, to make things work a little harder. I, I, I'm gonna have to spend a long time sat here thinking about this and just look at all those homeless people Why are you homeless? Because this place is rammed. Why aren't you moving? Why aren't you all moving over here? Well, you will as soon as uh, as soon as it's available, I suppose. Okay, and the time has taken the Asimov to arrive. We've got one of the the uh, concrete extractors here going. Unfortunately, it is the one that does the most, the least work. So uh, let's have a look up here. We can see the available deposit is oh, it's 129. That's a lot higher than I thought it was. I was expected to spot 50 or something like that there. Uh, I'm just gonna literally drop Asimov down in the corner here. I've been looking at this this. this dome here as I've been saying uh, you can see the unemployment and homelessness is pretty high I've opened up another shift in the polymer factory here and I don't think people are really gonna like uh, being uh, working overnight outside the dome I think that's gonna cause a few sanity issues but we should be alright this is a very very comfortable dome so hopefully that will work out all well for us I'm also waiting on this getting built over here but that obviously is uh, waiting on a bunch of resources that are on the way. I see food is starting to flood the systems again. It's taking its time though. It really would be good if we could get a good surplus up and running. I've got a feeling, unfortunately, with every new apartment I put down, we're going to need to put another farm's worth of stuff down. Which should be alright. Which should be alright. Let's have a look at mine. We've got a, a slight homelessness, but also some disabled work slots. Which, which work slots are disabled? So we've got four there and fifth on there. I, I don't know if if I want to have the overnight shift running or not, uh, but that that should kind of be okay. If we've got disabled work slots, this means we've not got any um, 
any joblessness on the go. Though, as soon as this gets built, that is going to suddenly become nine jobless people. How many jobs do we uh, take up here? Six. So maybe we need to put another farm down. I, I think we just one more farm shortage. would be okay. That's a bit of a problem right there. Where's the second dome without power? Why, why are you not, like, highest of priorities? Domes... Are Domes always take high priority. But more importantly, why did we run out of power just before the morning there? Uh, we obviously need to get ourselves some of uh, these. Where are they? These atomic accumulators. Oh, it's going to take a while. I'm going to do that. I'm also going to outsource um, this one here. It's going to take a little bit of time, but that should be fine. That should pick us up and have that tank coming pretty quickly. So we can get these batteries sorted and get ourselves onto a higher power play. Uh, man, this this dome, really got to figure out what to do about it. Okay, Asimov are ready to go home. That is looking pretty good. Still waiting on this stuff over here. It's almost all down to concrete now. Uh, so what's going on over here? This guy seems to be getting full up. Ooh, that's, that's a shame there. That is really a shame. Why does this guy not have enough drones? Why I think we need to start making a bit of a drone factory. Now, I was saying we've got an unemployment problem down here. The drone factory might be a way of uh, soaking up those people. I don't know how many workers it uses or what, but uh, we'll, we will go for it. No cable connection. Doesn't tell me where you need to connect the cable. Uh, let's, yeah, let's do it here. You can see how it's within both the hexes of the two domes here. So I think that's probably going to be a good shout. I want to turn this way so that I can see the dudes run out. Now, this is going to take a little little bit of stuff that we don't have you can see metals and electronics I suppose we're not being told that we've got problems with food uh, with pop Re reading that at the same time with metals uh, another dome with a power problem why why it's the, it's the lack of batteries I've not been putting them down but I really want to wait for this one I just I just got an idea it's going to be better now can we do anything about upgrading the ones we've got that that might be a plan let's come in here and get these ones no we've not actually got ourselves a system of upgrades for that that's a little bit of a shame I kind of hoped that that would be the case man these really do take their whiles to uh, to get Gun. Okay, it took some time, but this apartment is up. I'm expecting to see it fill up almost immediately, mostly from people down here. Uh, there's like 17 homeless or something like that down here, so I, I want most of them to come over here. They're taking their time, but I think they'll be all right. Yeah, okay, that, that works out we have pretty well. Shortage. No, 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 no. How can you say that? There is actually a food shortage. How far away from harvest are we? It's not that far tonight, this morning this morning so one person has to go without a meal for a day i don't know whether well nine people have to go without meals for a day i'm not sure whether there's anything going to come down the pipeline quicker no it doesn't actually look like there is that's a little bit of a shame oh look these guys are just laden with food laden mostly what we have now is a distribution problem Oh, of course, putting that farm up has given us a little bit of a water shortage, but we have this water grade here, so I think we can possibly take advantage of that. I'm just trying to find the drone hub that's out this way. There it is, over there, okay. So I want to try and put it as far away from the dome as possible, but at the same time, still usable. So let's go life support water extractor, something like here. I think will work out well for us. We'll just get some pipes running back over this way and of course with a little bit of power as well. Still waiting on those accumulators though. That's that's the thing that we're waiting on here. Well, a fusion reactor, that's also a good idea. Oh, we, we're getting close. We are very close. The outsourcing is still rolling in, so that's pretty good. Okay, so we finally got ourselves the atomic accumulator. That seems like a great time to just go and slap one down somewhere. Um, maybe about ooh, so somewhere like high traffic, I think, will probably be a good place so that we can make sure it gets fixed as soon as uh, possible. Yeah, let's try and throw one down here somewhere. In fact, we've got this nice little corner here where things will sit quite nicely. People are stealing electronics. I'm not to too keen on that. But looking through here, we're going to have a bit of a polymer yeah. situation. Situation. Food uh, the food shortage shouldn't be a problem. We've got food turning over very quickly all around us. Uh, this one actually needs to be soybeans. Thank you very much. Make sure that is right. So we seem to be just constantly ticking over on like four or five starving colonists at the moment. So I 
think we're kind of getting on top of the food. The problem at the moment is water. Thankfully, we got this one up and running now, but uh, that's definitely something to keep an eye out for. What is this? We're on buildings waiting for one of those to resume. I've not... Uh... Uh, I've not ran out, have I? Let's let's just try and find where my production for rare metals is. Aha! So this one stopped. Does it not tell me when things run out of resource now? Depleted. Okay, well that that's a thing. Let's just scrap that up. No point in having it anymore. Oh, this is gonna this is gonna mean I need to go around and check things. Like there, there's a good place to go. Uh, this one. Do we turn this now into a mining colony? I think we should. What were you mining in the past? You were mining normal metals, so you are now on the. No, not concrete, lol. Rare metals. Uh, requires deposit. I just want to kind of put it where it's not going to cause too much dust on the dome. Uh, I don't know if that's actually a problem or not, but I want to be aware. I want to be aware. Uh, so if this is a problem now, get rid of that. Let's also salvage up those cables. Nice, nice, nice. Going around replacing stuff. It's all good, man. It's all good, you know. Uh, what else do we need to do? Is, where, where else were there rare metals that I was mining? Like this one here. Okay, so you've just run out of rare metals as well. Let's uh, scrap you up. Make, make double sure you're depleted. Okay. Uh, also come down to the salvage and get rid of this little bit of cable here. No, no need to have it like causing maintenance drain. There, there literally is no other places, are there? Okay, so this one needs to somehow be got at. Um, we've got the Beagle too, but more importantly we've got Spirit. Where are you, Spirit? You're down there. There's a drone hub here instead though, so you should be okay. Let's come on over and park Spirit right about here, and then we can run a cable out across this one way if I could find my cables power cables nice uh, yeah let's let's come up this way that seems pretty good to me and that should make everything get fixed up and work a fine for us uh, now I need to go around all those things that I just destroyed and actually salvage them because it turns out destruction is a two-step process in this game uh, would you believe it this is outside of drone range wait let's have a look here ah literally just outside what's this one What's what's that? What's that? That's this drone. Why aren't you working? Power we problems. Have a power shortage. That's over here. But you've actually got enough power. Ah, no, no way of getting repaired. Okay, okay. So this needs to. Mm, it's it's that horrible time of the morning where nothing works for me. So we'll just wait for that to tick in. What's going on over here? Are these actually getting done? Uh, slowly but surely. I'm going to high priority that one and let's see if that ticks over any better. Food coming out. Mm, that's a good one. Okay, morning ro rolled in. Power started to flow. Suddenly everything works out pretty well for stuff. Uh, what's missing here? Metal. It's, it's likely, right? It's likely. Uh, we've got metal over there. I really want to start working on some of the, the things that actually give me metal. So, like, the mohole? Is that... Yeah, mohole. Let's, uh, let's put that at the top. Oh, I don't know. We, we're very close to getting that done. Uh, let's put that there. What I need to do is start switching over to a science-based economy. Like, is this is this place unemployed three? Um, we, we could put another science place up. Let's try that stuff. Oh, actually, we're one person we short. I think no, I think I'm all right with that. I think I'm all right. We'll just put a non-specialist down, a uh, non-specialist research place down. So, like this place, you can see it's only full of scientists. So we'll just keep filling the scientists in. Whereas this one, this will be uh, available for anybody and everyone. Okay, this dome has six unemployed. Do you know what that says to me? That says a new farm is needed. So that they cover six people, I believe. We have Let's a power click. Shortage. Yeah, six people there. So that's pretty good. This power problem is definitely an actual problem. But here we go. We we got this ticking over in the night. So as soon as morning comes around, which is going to take a little while. I don't know what time exactly morning arrives. The sun rises and everyone make, gets happy. Look at that overnight drop. That's that that is massive. And then suddenly we're up at six eight two. Um, hopefully, mostly that is from charging. That's why mostly um, because we normally have a surplus. Yeah, look at that. We normally have a surplus of several hundred. So, so uh, hopefully we're doing all right. I can or can but hope. Can but hope in a hopeful way. 
So this building is just taking too dang long and I'm a little bit fed up of running out of power every night. So I've ordered down a two rockets, one full of metals and one full of polymers. Unfortunately, I think this is now going to lead to me not having uh, any fuel on my on my base. But, you know, whatever, we'll, we'll live with that. Uh, now, hopefully all of this is just going to go straight to the project over there. We, I took 80 metals down and something like 200 polymers. Yeah, 200 polymers there and well, the, the metals are already going out and being divided around. Unfortunately, a lot of other things are going to require metal as well, so we can't rely on that to be a uh, totally cool source of income. Uh, we got the eight electronics down here, just waiting on the concrete. All the food, though, all the food. How about that drone factory? Has that got anywhere close to being done? Awesome. We've got people in there. We've got a three-person shift. I'm not so sure about died. that. Why? 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 So, someone committed suicide. What? But all, you're surrounded by so much food. Why would you do that? Oh, man. I don't, I don't know. These people. These people. Uh, right. So what, what are we doing here? Drone prefab uses, uh, is, can be used to order new drones in drone hubs. So we let's have a power just shortage. put like 10 down. Let's see what happens there. Power is a problem, though. This, this, these are not getting charged. That, that makes me sad. That makes me super sad. And things are not going over to this. Mm, that, that also makes me sad. Let's, uh, let's put the priority up there and uh, see if we can just make sure we usurp all the materials because that's what I brought them for. That is what I brought them for. Okay, a rare sighting of the banks here. Uh, hopefully, oh man, always these renegades. I really need to start sorting out a little bit of a security system here. Uh, but yeah, I brought the M banks down because the metal just kind of disappeared into the system, which I suppose is okay. You know, that this obviously needed elsewhere around, and I'll allow that to happen. But mainly, I really did want to get this built before the end of this episode. That is, that is my goal for today: is to get the artificial sun built. Okay, so we just got the farm automation research. Let's try it with this one here. If I click that, it's going to take two bits of electronics. Does it cost more on the maintenance there? So here come the electronics, yes. Uh, is, is that a thing now? A power shortage. Maybe, maybe not. I, I don't know. There we go. We're down to four people now. That's pretty sweet, pretty slick. Uh, I've also just remembered that, um, yeah, no, let's not do that one. Let's do soybeans. All right, awesome. Thankfully, I think that just got turned over, so that's pretty good do we want to turn down the number of workers here i don't know let's have a look uh we've got unemployed people still so i don't know maybe not maybe not oh oh it's built it's no is it it's, it's on its way to getting built it's not actually built but it's so 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 close now from what i'm given to understand this is now going to blast out a oh okay right what do we need we need water let's have a look insufficient water 100 it's going to take all my water off of me isn't it uh but i'm gonna live with that i'm gonna i'm gonna make do and go for the sake of progress we're going to try it we're going to do that and do this probably would have been better just to take a pipe down that way no we're gonna live with it we're gonna live with it and here comes the water now is it just gonna keep getting jugged in we have a i'm power not shortage. sure i'm a little bit a little bit unsure about how much water ah, ah wait 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 it's still not finished okay there we go uh how much water i've got stored that that's what i was trying to say there let's uh, actually pull this up and we go have a water, water. Mm, okay that's a little bit more troubling than i was letting on uh the, though we've got a stored water there so that's pretty good that is pretty good do i need to really find more water sources let's go out and have a look around i'm sure there are more to be got if we just try hard enough i'm gonna has died. oh no oh, oh i'm having a lot of people uh, a lot of people commit suicide on me recently but that's fine we're, we're, we're all right with that we're we're just at that size right that's that that's definitely what's going on it's totally totally not a count against my leadership skills no couldn't be couldn't be all right i want to see whether i can get a, a tunnel down from here to i don't know o over here all right that's nice i don't know if i've got the stuff for it probably not We'll, we'll wait for it though yeah we're doing all right we're doing all right uh the reason that i want that to go down is i want to start colonizing this place for the water obviously uh if we can make that a thing i will be very help help very happy um 
but let's try and do a few things around here we're going to go life support pipes and drag that up there like that and i'm also going to go for the power, power cables shortage. and drag that down there like that okay whilst these guys are freaking out about the power shortage and the water shortage we're going to see what we can do with this so this is definitely a water problem here is it 23 wow okay yeah this, this, this is a big water problem actually uh, so we need to kind of up the priority on this one if we can just steal everything for everything uh, in fact do we want to call hello what have we got do we want to put are you, oh you're ready for takeoff I thought you were ready for landing uh, we could bring we have a food shortage we could bring some stuff right we're, we're not worried about the machine parts because they'll turn up we're not worried about the concrete because that will actually turn up maybe a few metals but at the same time we're kind of doing all right on that as well maybe we just need to wait oh I'm not, I don't know about that waiting a colonist has died Wow, all seems to be on the go right now. Let's have a look in here. What's going on? Is we got someone dying of dehydration? Oh man, come on, we need to get this finished. Do I just like abandon all and go for some pipe work? I'd, I'd really like, I'd really like to not, if possible. We got the uh, the wonder achieved there. That's cool. I need five hundred, a thousand, and a mega dome just to tick off all those boxes. I think we can definitely do that at some point. But I think with the this getting rated as well. Deaths are a worrisome trend which cannot be ignored. While the applicants who come to Mars were aware of many of the risks that would await them, the near criminal neglect from our side is something different. We cannot keep this information from the public and opinions are swaying the direction that our colony is a death trap. This troublesome rumour has det uh, deters many candidates from coming to the new frontier. And these uh, these are people who desperately need to fulfil the greatest mission of colonising Mars and bringing our vision to future. Well, I mean, this is true. We are having a little bit of problems, but that is going to have to wait for next time. As we have finally got our artificial sun up, we are waiting for this to be built. And next Next time we will go across and I colonize this little go. area of the map so we can get a little bit more water because that's what most people are dying of but i will see you then when we're gonna do that bye look at that water shortage ow